Hi there. In this video, I'm going to do a quick demo and installation of Loot version 3. Loot is software that you install on your machine for learning foreign languages through reading. I'm going to do a quick demo, but before I do that, the guys over at Refold have made a really great video about Loot version 2 covering their features. It's well worth checking out even if the version was old and the installation was a bit hairier. So here's a quick demo just so you can see what Loot is. Loot is pretty simple. To summarize, you import and read books. You click on terms. All of these terms are blue because I don't know them. So I'll click on a term and I can add some information about the term using the form on the side. There's a dictionary here so I can look it up. And then I enter in some information about that term such as the translation, some tags, etc. I can also attach an image to a term. So this just does a quick uh, Bing image search. I choose an image and then it gets attached to my term. When I save, you can see that the reading pane has been updated. So now that term has been highlighted and the image has been attached. Now with loot, I can also, I can also associate terms. So in this case, this is just the plural of another term. So I just say that it's perros is the plural of perro and that's the parent term. So when I save that, now Perros has all of the information that I entered in before with the other term. So I process the text, and then when I'm done, I mark it as done. And that's Loot's core feature in a nutshell. So that's the end of the demo, or the idea. So now I want to show how easy it is to install. So this is version 3, which is a rewrite in Python. And on the website, you'll find uh, instructions on how to do the installation. There's a few different ways. I'm going to install it using pip. So I'm just going to copy all of this from start to, to the end here, or start to that, to that point, switch over to terminal, and I'm going to paste it, and I'm starting from nothing, and here we go, da, 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 da. this is real time, and now at the end of it, loot is actually running, and that's all that you need to do in order to get loot version 3 running on your machine. It's running on a particular port, you open up your website, and you're done. So it's so much easier than version 2. So here's the loot screen that you see when you first install. There's a bunch of things uh, pre-installed, like stories and languages and stuff. There's a tutorial, and I really recommend that you take a quick look at that at least. Um, it talks about uh, all the basics of loot, you know, um, reading, dictionaries, images, doing things like creating multi-word terms. You can... Um, you can very quickly set the statuses of terms using hotkeys, so just one, two, three, four, five. And when you're done with the tutorial, you um, can wipe out the database and start fresh. When you do that, Loot is automatically making backups for you because losing data sucks. So the very first thing you do when you wipe it is you create a new language. You can choose from a pre-built template. Click Go, click Save. And then once I've got that, I can make a book. So I'm just going to make a very short and silly book, just because you've already seen all this already. And then once again, I start, this is a fresh install, so I've lost the terms I made before. But once again, I would make a term with that funny cat, and there it is. Loot has other features, of course, um, like books, creating books, uh, importing them from a web page, uh, listing all of your terms, etc. You can do a CSV export from there, and you can do CSV imports from other places. Uh, Loot has a Discord, and there's quite a few channels, and there's a handful of people who are on there ready to help out, answer questions if you run into problems. So I would say the important thing for you to do right now is to actually try it out. Uh, install it. Try working through the tutorial. Uh, and join the Discord if you run into problems. And if you're a techie guy, then all of the code is available on GitHub, so please check it out. Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you try Loot. I hope uh, you find a tool that works very well for you anyway, no matter what it is. Thanks very much. Have a good one.